Good Monday morning, everyone. Father Andrew Dickinson here with your Newman Center update. Invite you to continue to break the mold to your Catholic life at SDSU. This Monday morning, I want to talk to you about cheering. Yep, that's right, cheering at football games. But first, a big thank you to everyone who came to the barn dance on Friday night. Great time. Over 350 people were there. Uh, took a little video of it when I was there. I think you'll enjoy it. Certainly seemed like we were all having a great time. This week, I am on retreat, so our regular mass schedule is a little different here for daily things, a little quieter here. Chapel's always open to pray. The Newman Center is always open to come in. There will be confessions Thursday at 4.30 and Mass at 9 o'clock with Father Matt Weering, who will be with us. But otherwise, we'll be a little laid back here. Also on Thursday night, Monica, our campus minister, will talk after the Newman Night Mass about spring break mission trip, about some retreat opportunities, just giving you some more info uh, for things to come in the semester. All right, I told you we would break the mold about cheering at football games. Now, I go to football games pretty regularly with SDSU, and I just have one small complaint. Actually, I've got two complaints. The first is, and I'm going to sound like an old man with this, don't leave early. Don't leave early. Just don't leave early. Stay. Commit. Hold out. Hold out to the end of the game. You never know what's going to happen. Whether we're blowing them out, whether we're struggling, stay to the end of the game. Please. The players really love it if we stay till the end. So I just encourage you, stay to the end. Number two is how we cheer. All right, now if you're in basketball, you cheer one way all the time. In football, you need to cheer differently whether you're on offense or defense. Offense or defense. So when you're on offense, you can go like this. And when you're on defense, you can go like this. Offense. Defense. Now, some of you might be asking, but but Father, what if we're on offense and it's it's third and two, or it's really important, you know, can't we? No, no, no. See, when we're on offense, we want to be able to hear what's going on, especially the players need to be able to hear what's going on. But when the opposing team is on offense, when we're on defense, that's when we can... Because we don't want them to hear. I hope that makes sense. Offense? Yeah. Defense? What if we're behind? Doesn't matter. On offense and defense. What if we're blowing them out? Doesn't matter. Offense, defense. All right. Well, I hope this week you can be the very best Catholic Jack you can be. I'll be praying for you while I'm on retreat and look forward to seeing you again next week. God bless you.